we're just about to release our new native data cake um, smartphone app and in this video I would like to show you how to connect the particle IO Boron to the data cake cloud and to bring this dashboard onto the smartphone app. So um, I have got a particle um, .io Boron here in my office it's sending a publish every 15 seconds. In this publish, there is the um, amount of or the count of Bluetooth devices nearby and the state of charge. Um, I've created an API device for it in the um, data cake portal. I already um, created two fields to hold the, uh, um, the published data. And next, I will configure the particle integration. So for this, we are going to copy the device ID um, and add a mapping the device and the event name is D0 which is the publish name and there is um, the Bluetooth count and the state of charge so first of all Bluetooth count and state of charge I save it and as the um, uh, webhook integration is already set we can see um, the particle event data here. So there's a debug tab. So next I'm going to create um, a dashboard. We are dropping two um, widgets onto the uh, dashboard. First of all the Bluetooth count and next is the battery level. So for battery level I'm going to add a, chart, uh, a gauge or a gauge as well. Um, and to ranges, ranges from green to red. Oh, that has to be the other way around. Um, we save that. We exit edit mode. We've got these two um, widgets here now. And now I'm going to switch to the app, reload it. I can see the particle I overrun. And when I open it, I can see the dashboard I've just created here. So, and to show you that this is real, um, we could add, for example, a headline here and say this is um, live values. Save that. Edit exit exit edit mode. Go into the dashboard from the app, and as you can see, the dashboard has been updated. So. Um, it just takes a few weeks until the app is in the app stores and then it will be released free first of all for iOS and then um, later we will um, add the support for Android. So thanks for watching and stay tuned.